or Chief Meteorologist Brian Davis and your Storm Team 2 forecast. Well, we just had wall-to-wall -wall sunshine, beautiful October blue skies out there, and sunset very shortly here in about 15, 20 minutes. And we'll be looking at clear skies at 7 o'clock, 60, coming down quickly this evening, 54 at 9, down to 50 at 11 p.m. And then tomorrow morning at 8 o'clock, sunny skies, 47. And look at that temperature jump by noon into the upper 60s with mostly sunny skies, 77 degrees at 5 o'clock. We should be hitting highs tomorrow into the upper end of the 70s. And what gorgeous weather out there, of course. Of course, our main uh, news anchor, Mark Allen, he was out on the bike on Friday. And look at this beautiful shot of Caesar Creek Lake and the fall colors down there. Hopefully, you got a chance to get out there and enjoy it. You can still do it over the next half hour or so. You can see our sunset there as the sun dives towards the southwest horizon. Over in Beaver Creek at the Phillips Companies there, our uh, Storm Team 2 weather camera showing that beautiful shot tonight. So, with those clear skies, look for low temperatures to head down most areas into the mid and upper 40s, but a few of the outlying spots. Especially to our east, could reach the lower end of the 40s again tonight. But what a warm up tomorrow! Unseasonably warm conditions on a south breeze that'll pick up late morning and into the afternoon. Should carry our highs into the upper 70s. Cincinnati, maybe even near 80 by the end of the day, and that'll put our temperatures about 20 degrees above normal. But you can see a little bit of a change over the Plain States. That's our next cold front that'll bring us a chance of rain on Tuesday. That high tomorrow of 78 degrees. It'll be pretty close to the record high of 81 back in 1897. And right now, looking at live Doppler 2 HD, it's dry here in the Dayton area. Troy, Springfield, over to Xenia, looking at dry conditions in the rest of the Miami Valley. That's the way it should stay tonight and into tomorrow. We hit a high today of 68 after dropping down to 43. So temperatures today even running a little bit above normal. And right now, we're at 64, a west wind at 7 miles an hour, and 65 degrees tonight in Eaton with a light southwest wind at 5. Our weather checkers, mid and upper 60s across the region tonight in Fairborn, Williams. William Neva 66, Jason Thompson 69 in Brookville. Future track forecast tonight showing the clear skies through the night through 2 o'clock into tomorrow morning at 6 o'clock. Then we'll see a few of those scattered clouds uh, tomorrow afternoon, but still all in all expecting a mostly sunny day as we look at those unseasonably warm temperatures tomorrow afternoon. Clear skies tonight. It'll be cool, light variable winds, overnight low around 45, mostly sunny, breezy, unseasonably warm tomorrow. We'll climb up to 78 degrees. A quick Quick rise in the temperatures tomorrow morning, 59 at 10 o'clock, and then breezy, warm into the afternoon as we get into the upper 70s, even close to 80 degrees southwest of us. Cooling off a little on Tuesday as the rain chances come back. Could see some showers and thunderstorms. And then a cool down on tap for Wednesday and Thursday, and even chillier by Halloween with a slight chance of showers. So enjoy the warm weather while it's around tomorrow. I'm going to take advantage of it, that's for sure. Yeah, it's going to be hard to work tomorrow with that uh, yeah. 70. And you know we're not going to get many more days like that. I'm pleading ignorance to that, so I'm hoping <laughs> it stays that way. Well, thanks, Brian. Hutch is here with a look at sports. Well, the weather wasn't the only thing. Put